Okay, this bit of software was produced for Holstein UK by Breeze and Freeze, and it's designed to teach people dairy cow classification scoring, particularly for the Holstein breed. So we came up with this concept to show people how these animals were scored, and we started off by modelling the ideal Holstein cow, and she's modelled as a perfect model. This was actually hand-drawn, um, and the beauty of it now is that we've got it in 3D, so you can interact with it, have a good look round, see what this this animal looks like. A bit dizzy at the moment. And you can zoom in, get a closer look. So great for showing. Kids kids love this. Kids love playing around with the, the interactivity of this model. But if you look at the score down the left hand side, you've got the stature, chest width, all these parts of the animal are scored so that you can come up with a total score for what is perceived as the ideal Holstein animal. And then from this, perhaps you want to look at a particular trait. So we can go to the individual traits. So they're all here. Um, so there's stature, rear teat position, all these things are scored. So if we look at just teat position as an example. Uh, so there we have it. That is a score 5 as you can see on the bottom here and you can see what a 1 looks like and a 9 and so on. You can find out what the score for your animal is. So um, just have a look at Rump Angle there just as a, another example. There's a 5 and you've got a 1 and a 9 and so on. So that as a, a new person new to the business you can get an idea of how to score these animals. There are also some little uh, locomotion videos to just show how Council lameness is scored. Problems with her legs and feet. This so would score a one cow obviously is very lame and she's a one. And you can look down and go to a, a score eight or nine and get an idea of what they're all like. Cow 198 scores an eight and demonstrates very good locomotion. But to score a perfect nine would need her right hind leg to track a little better. So they're, they're all very subtle nuances that people in the trade will understand. And it's a good method of training people how to pick these individual traits up. So there you have it. The, uh, this was the 3D uh, virtual daisy, as we called it, but the virtual cow. Really nice way of, of uh, delivering information to a remote workforce or to help people to learn dairy cow scoring. If you want to know more about this, give us a call at Breeze and Freeze or talk to Holstein UK.